The Foodstuffs project presented a unique opportunity. The uh, scale of the project was 75,000 square metres. So th this one here had a unique challenge in that the uh, operation was going to be suspended from a crane eight metres in the air. So we had to get all our health and safety in a row. Uh, we had to get our head around the, the concept. It was a concept that we'd, we'd been uh, wanting to do for a while. This was an innovative joint development between ourselves and Diamond Roofing. And the reason it was used on this project is because we saw a chance to do something different. This was the first time this process has been used in New Zealand and it was developed because of the site challenges. We had li very limited boundaries and uh, logistically craning through the centre of the building was not going to be uh, achievable. The benefits actually started to appear more so as we got right into the project. So the, um, initially we thought it would be faster, but we just didn't realise how much faster. So yeah, that was a benefit to us, there's a labour save in there. Uh, there's also obviously benefits for our, our customer, so in terms of craneage, so that was really the big driver. Craneage is a huge cost on these projects. The benefits of using Roll to Roof have stacked up very well. We're in control of our costs and there has been no surprises. The main contractor ended up getting a roof that was two months earlier than expected. So wind actually wasn't a big factor for us. It was a um, it was a concern, and especially with the location of that site, being exposed to the westerly winds. So we expected to have quite a number of down days where we couldn't run. Uh, over the period of the whole project, it ended up in one day we couldn't run. The client is extremely pleased with the result, and there is already talk about other future projects. <laughs>